In this video, I want to share with you how I create the Daily Brilliance Nuggets. What you see here is actually a page inside of Notion, N-O-T-I-O-N. This is a tool I use a lot. You can find it at notion.so. And what you have here is a board where it goes from the idea to an idea with notes to one that is recorded to then the stage where it is the video is edited. For example, I may trip over my tongue and then I just pause for a moment and repeat it. We'll cut that piece out. So when that's happened, then we get to the point of publishing it. And in fact, there are a couple more steps that happen here, uh, editing the transcript and creating the image, which so far I have not created as separate steps in this brilliant nugget journey, as I call it. This is something that I have evolved over time. And I want to give you an example here. Today I recorded batching is powerful. But what I do is when I thought of the idea, I just wrote batching is powerful. And this idea may occur to me while I'm sitting at a traffic light and I pull out my phone and I find this page, I click on this blue new button and I just type in real quick or even dictate batching is beautiful. Later on, when I actually think about this further, here's what I do. I go to another website. It's called monsterinsights.com forward slash headline hyphen analyzer. And I type in what I think would be a good and intriguing headline. So let's say I type in batching is powerful. And I analyze it and it comes out with 61. Well, as it turns out, I actually thought of a slightly different twist on that headline and it's batching is beautiful because truly it is. And voila, it comes out with a rating of 76. So when it's green, that means that's a good headline. So I'm now taking that headline and I'm copying it now that I'm happy with it and I open this page. This is actually, the, each of these items is actually its own page and I'm now changing this to the headline. As soon as I headline, have a headline that I like, I'm going to change the status to notes. In this case, I don't need to put a bunch of notes here for this particular nugget because I have that in my head. I've even written about it before. Therefore, what I can do is I can actually record this. So you can see that Batching is Beautiful is now shown under Notes. When I record it, I move it over. In fact, I have recorded it. And when the video is edited, then I will move it over. And once it's been published, I will move it over to the Publish tab. And that is, in a nutshell, how I create the Brilliance Nuggets. What happens next is, in between video editing and publishing, is that the transcript will be extracted out of Loom.com, which is where those videos sit. And then it goes into Grammarly, where it will be edited. From there it goes into WordPress, where it sometimes it will be edited a little bit more. The image goes into it, and also there is a light touch of SEO-related activities, namely a focus word is added, and a meta description is added as well. So that is the description that shows up when you look for it on Google. And that, in a nutshell, is the Brilliant Nugget journey. I hope this is useful to you from the perspective of either you wanting to write your own nuggets and publish them, or just to see how you can outline a process and 
make a recording that can help you outsource certain steps of this. Let's say the video editing. I can tell someone with a separate video how do I want this editing to happen and then I can outsource that step. And I can give them access to this Notion page by sharing it right here and therefore then they can say, okay, here are all the videos that are recorded and are ready for video editing. Let me take care of these. And when that's done, they can move it over here. And then I can see, ah, it's ready. I hope that's helpful to you.